So now let's add a multiple choice question to the pool. So let's go down to multiple choice. Give it a title. I'm going to call this clown face for obvious reasons, as you see afterwards. Um, question text. Now we need to put in an image, so you, you must browse from your computer, and um, you can't browse from the content collection. So this is on my computer, clown.jpg. Click on open. Action, what we need to do is, we don't want a link, but we want to display the image within the page. Numbering, let's have it as Arabic numbers, one, two, three. Okay, as you can see now, the uh, image has been added there. Orientation could be vertical or horizontal. Allow partial credit if you want. Show answers in random order. Okay, I'll do that. I won't allow partial credit. Number of answers is four answers. Um, you can have up to 20. If you only have three answers, you will have to remove one of these. So you could remove this if we I just want three answers. Okay, so I've got three answers here now. Answer one. Sad answer to happy. That's probably the correct answer. And then answer three serious. Correct response feedback. Incorrect. Okay, categories and keywords again. Let's add a category. You can choose from existing. For example, okay, we've got grammar. Topics, choose from existing. Um, this would be maybe people. Levels of difficulty, mm, maybe easy. Actually, probably more middle. And then we can delete the easy tag by just removing it here. Okay, keywords. Um, of course, it would be adjectives maybe. You can add instructor notes. When we're ready, we can click on Submit. Click on Submit, and now we can see that the third question has been added.